Okay, so I came in the EMU on Friday. It's Sunday now. I just took my first shower in here. And it's not great because I don't get to wash my head because of all the electrodes. This is so fun. Oh, you have a great roommate. I have an awesome roommate that looks pretty much exactly like my best friend. Which you is don't look like yes, her. yes, she does. <laughs> And, because it's so hot in here, even though it's a hospital, I got ice. <laughs> it's awesome. <laughs> so, hi. I'm Virginia's roommate. Um, she's been in here, what, three days now? Yeah, three days. And I think I'm on day five. I've yeah. I've been in here since Wednesday. Wednesday. So, two days before. So, three plus five. Two is five. No <laughs> yep. math skills. Um, we kind of like each other. We kind of get along. Yeah. I kind of been ignoring it. <laughs> it's super natural, but that's all cool because she got friends coming. Um, yeah, we um we both haven't had seizures, and that's a great thing, except for the fact that they want us to. So um, yeah. We'll keep you updated. <laughs> Bye! Hey, so it's Tuesday. It's my fourth day here. I actually had two grand mal seizures within nine hours. Uh, the first one was around 2 a.m. last night, and the second one was around 11 a.m. And I bit my tongue both times. So I'm seriously having trouble with talking properly. Um, big headache, for sure. And I pretty much slept all day after my second seizure. Um, I'm actually going to go back to this. <laughs> because it's so exhausting. And uh, they took me off. Uh, kept her completely and then I guess that's what causes seizures uh, but they're keeping me on they're putting me back on like 500 per day 500 milligrams um, per day so that uh, I can have the smaller seizures so they can have that on record as well um, pretty interesting. My sister thought it was uh, scary, uh, that it would be scary to watch my own seizure, but actually I, I found it very educational, which is pretty cool. Um, being irritated by this, it's like it's itching like crazy all over my head, and then every time I have a seizure, this kind of hat thing that keeps it on my head kind of comes off and then you try and you know. yeah apparently after my my seizure this morning I tried to take uh, the electrodes off while I was still recovering from the seizure but I have no memory of that whatsoever I what yeah I was pretty much put to bed just right after that. Yeah. How's your day? My day is pretty good. I got to see my... Yeah. Okay. So I got to see my father and my aunt today. And, um, it's a pretty good day. Um, dad left around two and then aunt... Kelly came around six, I had about four hours there where I would just chilled and watched Supernatural. <laughs> um, I think I'm on day seven that I've been here. So I'm getting really like, ugh, I want to go home-ish. Um, yeah, I'm trying to think what else I was going to say. <laughs> Any seizures? Oh, yes, I've had one seizure today. It was, um... A grandma? No, it was a petite mom. Um, okay. My grandma. Well, I did, but only medication induced. Um, it was around 2 o'clock in the afternoon. 
Um, I think that was from lack of sleep, though, because I'm a light sleeper, so... And waking up because of my seizures? Yeah. I had just gone to bed, like, an hour before her seizure, right? Mm. So I was, like, just falling asleep, and then she had her seizure, and it was about... I would say a good hour to an hour and a half before we both were able to fall asleep after your seizure. Mm. So, it's been a long day. Um, it's about 10.35 here, so we'll probably both go to bed pretty soon. Mm-hmm. Um, for sure. Yeah. Um, so this is day seven for me and day four for her. Let's hope for more grandmas for y you. <laughs> <laughs> and more, more smaller seizures for me. Yeah, I've only had one though. Like in the seven days I've been here, I've had one seizure. That's like impossible. Like that's amazing to me because I normally have like forty seizures a day. It's just because I'm not moving around that I'm not having any. But yeah. I'm starting to get like um, headaches and stuff mm -hmm. from um, them mm. taking away all my medication. Yeah. So, we'll see how that goes. I mean, it's not too bad right now, but it's, like, always a dull pain behind my eyes. Like, behind my head. Behind my head. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. In my brain. Yeah, in your brain. I I have that pain, too. Yeah, so, we're probably going to go to bed this soon. We got chips today from my aunt. I have Doritos. two bags over here. Where are the other ones? Uh, all dressed in uh, sweet chili heat sour cream. Uh. Or sweet chili sour cream misfits. I don't know how to say. Okay, <laughs> hey, bye. 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 I can see all this. <laughs> Hello. So officially today is day ten. Uh couple days ago on day eight I got to take my first full shower and trust me eight days without a shower on your head it's like heaven that's that's all I can say <laughs> any um, thoughts on how what the shower was like. <laughs> oh, it felt great, actually. I was day, uh, I think it was day 10 before I got to take a shower. Like, yeah, you were day... Yeah, I was day 10. No, you were day 9 when you got to take a shower. Oh, day 9, okay. And now I'm on day 12. Right. You got to take a shower yesterday, too, though. Uh, no, I only got to wash my hair yesterday. Oh, okay. shower. Okay. They wanted to redo this really quickly. Well, it felt great though. <laughs> yeah, do you want to um, expand their knowledge about the nachos and the peanut butter? Yeah. We got Doritos and peanut butter together. It tastes like popcorn, cheesy popcorn. Smells like it too. And it tastes awesome. Would you agree? Yeah. It's awesome. Mm -hmm. Bye. My 18th day. Finally going home. So glad to be going home. Today I'm going to be able to see my dog after 18 days of being in the hospital. feels like it's been forever. Being at home and being able to sleep in my own bed definitely makes a huge difference. I have nothing bad to say about the EMU except for maybe that the adhesive used uh, to keep the electrodes on my head were kind of itchy <laughs> but anybody who has been in the EMU would know that um, other than that there's nothing bad to say I made awesome friends while I was there and 
it was pretty cool. Nothing bad. Pretty awesome. The nurses are awesome. That's for sure. Also, anybody who has to go into the EMU, I suggest um, not picking at the electrodes because you will get stuff like this where it kind of rips off a bit of your skin and makes some scratches or whatever. Um, when you do finish in the EMU, um, I suggest putting uh, loads of conditioner in your hair to get all the adhesive as much as you can get it out of your hair because I actually still have some in my hair and it's really irritating. Um, but other than that, good luck.